Seth Cannon and the Carriers, a three-piece rock band from Covington, Ohio, quickly making a name for themselves in the Miami Valley. We caught up with them to get their story. Isaac moved across the yard from me, and uh, my brothers played music, and so Isaac and I both picked up instruments, and we just sat on each other's back porches and annoyed the neighbors and stuff, and we called it the Carriers. Then we started, we added Zach in it, and it was Isaac's idea to do the whole Seth Cannon and the Carriers thing just because it kind of has that Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers type of thing or Huey Lewis in the news, something. We kind of knew we wanted something like that. If you were to describe the sound of Seth Cannon and the Carriers, what would it be? John Hendry of Trojan City Music in Troy, I think he summed it up the best way. I think he said, if Angus Young and Tom Petty got together and listened to a bunch of Neil Young and some Led Zeppelin, I think maybe sprinkle a little Foo Fighters in there for this guy and we got pretty close to what we have. <laughs> so you kind of described your sound a little bit. What's the lyrical content of, of it all? What are you guys talking about? What are you writing about? What do you want people to get out of your music? I write a lot about the loss of innocence and stuff and trying to find some of it while knowing that you're gonna, you're definitely gonna lose some of it, you know, and you'll never get it back, but there's some things you can retain. There's that and kind of just some of the little feelings that I guess you never, people don't have names for exactly, and just there's specific uh, situations that I think everybody goes through and try to relate to that, be specific enough to make a story, but at the same time keep it ambiguous to be inclusive. Is there any one particular band or singer-songwriter that you guys would love to collaborate with? Well, I just recently, uh, collaborated with one of those who I would love to, uh, the Typical Johnsons. They they play a bunch, I mean, so much in Dayton. And uh, Jeremy, he's a, a lead guy for that. He, an incredible songwriter, he asked me to rework one of his older songs, put a new guitar riff on it, and I was throwing it around for a few weeks and sent it to him, and we just recorded it uh, with Patrick Himes over at Real Love Recording uh, in Dayton. And it was just an awesome experience. We we all kind of came into it. No one really had any expectations other than, I think this will be good. And it turned out to be one of the most fun sessions. What's the ultimate goal for Seth Cannon and the Carriers? I think as long as we just keep making good records and playing good live shows, that's, that's kind of mostly where we're at. But of course, it would be nice to be able to do that on a larger level and be able to make a living off of that. Yeah, a girl asked me down in Texas, don't you want to make it? And I said, well, as long as we get to play music and have fun and they're having as much fun watching, that's making it to me. It's, yeah. it's good enough. <laughs>